Six cage tractors, what could go wrong? What's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a great day. We are back on Dull Ranch and we are getting everything done. Right here we have both of the harvesters almost, well, I think they're both pretty close to being full. Very end of it. What do we got right now? If we could bump over to it, where is it? 178,000 liters of oats. It's a little much. There's a lot of oats over there. We're going to take this whole field right here. We're going to collect the straw. We don't need the straw, really. At the end of the day, we don't need the straw. So instead of keeping it or bailing it, which is going to take a lifetime, we're going to take it and we're going to sell it all. I've put down another placeable. Unfortunately, we're not getting a great price for the new placeable. It's only 96 bucks and it's going down. That's bell sales. So we are going to be taking everything to barn. Well, we got to get it all picked up first. And before we even do that, we've got to get all this delivered. So this is going to be about another eh, close to 30,000. I think we're going to get right around 29,000, maybe something like that. But we got all these trailers hooked up to it, rocking and rolling. But we've got a lot of work to do with this field. What field are we in right now? Goodness, it needs lime. You're like, all right, needs lime. Cool, what if we lime it? Doesn't need plowing. Yes, <laughs> that pumps me up way more than you know. But we need to lime it. So we're going to lime it, and then we're going to come through, and we are going to plant our next crop. I think it's going to be soybeans. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I think we're going to do soybeans next. The whole idea behind this series is we're allowed to own one field at a time. Only one. Now we started with field four, probably should have started with field one. If I'm honest, we have one and then save enough money to sell one and buy two and then three and then four and five and six since they go in that order. But we are gonna go directly from four to six. <laughs> Speaking of six, it's right here. Yo, is there a, a, uh, a work? Oh gosh, field six. Sewing. Wait, field six sewing. It needs to be harvested first, dude. Four hundred and fifty-one thousand dollars. <laughs> I don't know if you guys were around the last time we were on here, but I've put this guy down right here. We have one point two million liters possible to keep. Uh, we have used the silo extensions, the modded versions. I gotta be honest, there were some guys asking me about these. I have no idea where I got them. No clue whatsoever. But if you shoot me an email, I'll give you the mod. Very easy. Uh, email is in my about me section, djgohamgaming at gmail.com. So this is good. We're done here. Hey, look at that. There's our little bell sales. Go there. We need somewhere to put this truck though. I need a drive. Th I need a drive through, but we need a big one. A very, very big one. Would this work? Is this a drive through? I think there's a door at both ends. Yo, this might be it right here. This may be the thing. Oh, we don't, we don't own that. Um, here maybe? I, I feel like putting it here is probably not the best place to go because getting in and getting out is dangerous. This is not a good place either. What about right here? I feel like getting in and, in and out of this area is also bad. Yeah. Maybe we just won't use this. I made the thing. Yeah. All right, let's get all these guys closed up because we're going to put this away for the, the, the winter. Maybe. I don't think it's for the winter. Oh, there's a bump. Yeah, maybe I should have fixed the bump. Bring through here. And the idea is to whoop, drive in one side and drive straight through to the other. I think we can make that happen. Seems like a big building just for this, but... Hey, we can do what we want. Y'all go. Bring it right here and step. Perfect. I like it. Before we get anything else started, I have decided to make a little bit of an extra area here on the end. I knew our harvesters needed somewhere to go, somewhere that is covered. We only need to fix that bump back there. So what I did was I put this together right here. Just a nice area. We're going to put both the harvesters under here, maybe some larger stuff, you know, cultivators, seers, planters. Stuff like that. So we put this together right here. Yeah. And then we just kind of made a little driveway around the back. Nothing too crazy, nothing too fancy, but hey, it works. Now it's time to get the lime going. No, 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 no. 
I need to pick up the straw. Dang it. Ah, yeah. We got us a brand new Magnum. This is new. We didn't buy this last time around. I was like, you know what? I need, I need another one. So I bought another case Magnum. We've got the rear duels on this one. I did throw the Agri Bumper on the front. And of course we have the Shooter Maker on the back. I have custom painted this one so that it is case red with black on the top and silver wheels. What do you guys think? I am digging this one. I am loving, 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 loving it. Let's see, let's put this down. Do we hit headlands down at the bottom of the top or do we just spin the headlands whenever we go through? I'm kind of thinking that we do the headlands. Like we rock rock out and get these headlands down. I know we've only got one, one thing down each side, but you know what? I think we're gonna do that. So let's rock through, let's drop that down. And I'm gonna try and hit this as tight as I can. There we go, about right there maybe? Yes, I think this is good. Very, very good. So this is gonna be able to go as fast as when we possibly can. We've got the case going at 32 miles an hour and that's gonna be exactly how fast we do all of this collecting. There we go. Oh, mate, got it. Make the turn, make the turn. It goes so fast, it just doesn't want to turn. Can we get it out? Oh, we missed just a little bit. That's all right, we'll pick that up. So we're gonna be able to do this at two swaths each. This should be good. We're getting a lot, holy cow, we got 63, four, 5,000 liters of straw already. This is gonna be a lot of straw. Side headland done, if you wanna call it a headland. And then we'll run through here, we'll get this. That way we've got somewhere to turn around and the lines kinda start where they're supposed to. You can see it doesn't really start for a minute. Eh, this is working great. I'm loving it. But how many, how many thousands of liters are we gonna get? And do we sell now? Oh, slow down. Do we sell now or do we wait? I don't, I mean, what if we get a better price for straw later on? Again, we're not using straw for anything. We have no animals. This is an animal free zone. All the animals have been sold, so we do not have them. It's just arable, just arable, that's it. And no grass, by the way, no grass. We, we can make too much money with grass. So that's why we collect the straw. I think we're gonna get a lot from this, well over a million liters. Well, I was pretty darn right on the money with this one. Ah, uh, 1.3 million liters. Yo, that's not too bad. That's money too, that is big money. Well, uh, that's like $100 per thousand liters. So that's, take away two zeros. Uh, not a whole lot, is it? Let's get this folded up, get it raised up, bring it in, there you go. So we got the case on here right now, case Magnum. Just curious, we have one Maxim, we have a Puma, one Optum, two Magnums, and one Quad Track. You're about to see some of those here in just a few minutes because we're gonna go back through. Uh, I do have some plows lined up, but unfortunately we don't need the plows, nor do we need the cultivator because all we need to do is put lime in the ground. Where's the best price to sell? I totally forgot, time has been going by. $141 at barn. Yeah, I think you know exactly where we're going. So we're gonna do that. We're putting soybeans in the ground. I'm debating on what to use to do that. I mean, you guys might be able to help me out a little bit with this one. I, I think we would almost be doing a disservice to ourselves if we didn't use the seed hawk. So I'm thinking, seed, oh, are we gonna be able to fit in here with duels? I know this mod has a hard time with tools. Oh, we barely fit. Uh-oh. Well, we fit, but our tractor, our trailer didn't. Um, what? This is, this is tough. We're gonna go about this a little bit of a different way. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take two case magnums and we're gonna rock those on something smaller. Uh, we have not gotten the this is barn, right? Yep, this is barn. I guess the tip is all the way in the back, is it? Oh, come on, just let me sell it. Oh, I get so frustrated. It's like, just do it. Okay, yep, it's all the way in the back. Actually, back way, way back here. We should have backed in from the other end. So this should net us a little bit of good money. 
We're gonna take these while this is selling because this is gonna take a good, uh, good little while. It's at 1.2 million liters still. We're gonna go ahead and buy the cedars. So let's rock through here. Cedars. One of them, I think, needs to be. I say, I think. I know one of these needs to be the seed hawk, and we've missed it. There it is. The seed hawk XL toolbar 84 foot. One of these has to be. One of these mods has to be this because we have the quad track. What better to pull it with? So let's grab this. Let's, um, you know what? Purchase. We're going to buy it. Stand, yeah, standard wheels. I hate that thing on the back. And then we've got the case magnums. Now, the magnums rock 435 horsepower. This Terminator right here needs 450. So technically, it shouldn't work. However, it is on flat ground, so I wonder if it would. So we could go with a 15 meter, or we could go with the 18 meter here. The thing about the 18, ah, you know, I, I, I'm sitting here talking crap. Let's just go with the Condor. It works. <laughs> we could go with the with the Stara, but it's just a little bit too much, I think. Let's go with this. We're going to buy two of these. There we go. Money is down, 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 down. Let's bump around. Let's see. Where are we? This needs lime. That needs lime. These are just fine. So we're going to hook up to uh, hook up to everything over there. And we got a quad track in the very back. Yeah, it's tell you what, this farm's coming together. It's coming together. Oh, we're almost done here. All right. What are we going to get for our final price right here? One hundred and eighty eight thousand dollars in straw. Just think if we would have not done anything with that. Actually, think if we would have bailed that. We wouldn't even be halfway done. We may be done with bailing by now. We definitely would have to pick everything up with the auto collector. Hey, at least we've got some brand new auto collectors in. So that's pretty cool. Tell you what, let's park this up and let's put this right here. I think this is the perfect spot for it. I love these little bell cells because you've got all kinds of neat little areas to store stuff and place things. Oop, just like that. There you go. Let's head down. Let's make this lime happen. Lime is almost ready. We've got two lime bags here just so we can go ahead and fill them up. There we go. Here's one. Let's double check, make sure that helper buy seed and fertilizer is turned on and it's turned off. That is not good at all. Seed buy, fertilizer buy, slurry buy. Why not? Buy, 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 buy. Bring it away. So we get the magnum or the maxim rather on one of these. We're just going to take it down, set it on a worker, come back, grab our Puma or Puma, however you want to call it. And we're going to grab that. We're going to do the same thing. These are going at I think it's about 12 miles an hour at 26 meter spread. Oh yeah, it's a big spread. Bring this here, set it on a worker. We're gonna waste a little bit, but that's okay because I need a headland. All right there, hard worker, yep. Yeah, money's going down, money's going, oh gosh, money's going down a whole lot. Um, We, we may need to go sell those oats. What's our oats selling for right now? 2579 bucks. Yeah, that's that's kind of the price I'm, I'm looking for. We need a we need we're going to have to do a double dump or something, I think. Headlands are done and the workers are hired. There's one and here's the other. Oh, we forgot to shut the top. Eh, he'll be all right. I don't think we're going to be getting rain anytime soon. So let's take a look just to make sure everything is going nice and smooth. Oh, we've got the lime thing turned off. Here we go. Let's turn that back on. Cool. So the entire map needed lime, however, not much needed plowing. So that's nice. So this is our field right here. We're rocking and rolling. We're having a good time. Everything is going well. The thing is, this goes a little bit slow. So maybe we'll have to figure out a way to make this go a little bit quicker. But uh, I think it'll be okay for now. We'll be good. We need to make some money. And how are we going to do that? Well, we're going to go sell. We're gonna sell the oats. So we've got a new truck and a new trailer. Borrowed something from a buddy of mine down the road. What we've got is his logging truck with a big crampy trailer. Now, of course, this crampy trailer is one of our mods, but for the sake of this, it's our buddies down the road. And it gives us a chance to use this truck, which goes 59 miles an hour and has 800 and some crazy odd horsepower. Only thing is, it's got this stuff, the logging stuff on the back and well, as you know, I'm such a huge fan of logging. Uh, 
the thing is, it's kind of clipping through the tractor a little bit. It's, it's clipping through the cab. It's, it's fun. I don't care. But I'm sure some of you guys are like, no, I can't stand that. But then again, this is probably not meant for this anyway. Though I'm going to continue to use it as such. Oh, slow down. This thing's got great brakes. It's got really, really good handling. Backs up at 10 miles an hour. Holy cow. Oats. 207 thousand liters of oats this may take us a minute to get through now where are we selling this at we're selling them at pv grains pv isn't that a speaker and like a guitar company pv <laughs> goodness gracious so we're going to pv grains where's pv grains is it down here i'm guessing nope that's sell point number two pv grains right here so that's going to be just south of the field where we're at cool I'm a little confused, because the way I've set these, they shouldn't be down turning and I need to check on these guys. Cruz said it, yeah, yeah. Going eight miles an hour, or 12 miles an hour rather. Are these guys, yeah, 12 miles an hour, okay. Maybe something was just up. Hey, none of my business, none of my business. Let's finish loading up, see how much money we can make. So we've got our oats in here. But I will say, when you take turns, this is pretty unrealistic. And yes, I am the one saying that. I get the irony. <laughs> but it's a cool truck, man. It's a really cool truck. I love the way it looks. Uh, somebody was telling me that uh, I'd, I'd made the mention that I wanted to have this version without the, without the hook in the back. And uh, they said, well, we already have that game. And I beg to differ. It's not. I want this truck. It's cool. It's super powerful. My goodness, it is super powerful. I love this truck. I really, really do. And again, the fact that we can go 59 miles per hour makes this, I think with the exception of the Lizard SX Heavy, one of the fastest trucks in the game. We could take a look real quick. Let's see. So the SX Heavy goes 49. Wow. Okay, so it goes 51. Interesting. This is the oh, we're getting off the we're getting off course. Anyway, this is the only one that goes that fast. What? I love this thing. It's so cool. I love it. I love it. I love it. This must be our cell point up here on the right. I don't know how to get in there. I think this is it right here. Let's see. Cut our turn signal on. Yeah. Oh boy. Naturally, right? Why? Uh, why would it be any different? Sorry. Oh, it comes back this way. There we go. That was about dangerous, wasn't it? All right, pull through here. Now, what are we going to get? We have 207,000 liters. The price is a lot. Wait, is this it? Or is that it over there? And why am I stuck? I didn't, I didn't drive into anything. Is it back here? Is this it? But why would it not be there? What's the, that's the cell point building. This doesn't make any sense to me. All right, well, you know what? Let's back in and let's find out. Nice and easy, maybe I should've just pulled through. Probably would've been a little bit easier. Yeah, getting the unload level, okay. Let's unload, let's see. Oats are going down, money's going up. It's kind of nice when you can trade oats for money like that. So we're already in the 200, holy cow, 200,000, almost $300,000 range. How much money are we making off of this? Oh my goodness, that's a whole lot of money. We made $535,000 off of that sale. That one sale. How far are we from being able to buy this field right here? 7.7 .7 million, holy cow! How much to sell this one? 1.2? Okay, can we sell our farm? Yeah, we can. We're not going to, but we can. So, we need 1.27, 6.5 million dollars more than we have right now. You guys have any money I can have? <laughs> We're gonna keep going, man. We're gonna keep going and see if we can make the money to make it happen. And naturally, they're missing little bits and pieces. Of course they would. 
rabble. Let's get this put away. Let's get our cedars ready to go so that we can get stuff in the ground so we can make a little bit more money. Don't ask why. I just felt that it was important to have the buy anything mod. <laughs> I don't even think I can use this. Rock through. Um, actually, what, what happens if we... I need my help window on. I can't see. Open cover. Okay. This. Oh, this isn't going to turn out well at all. Oh, oh, bad, 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 bad. Um, yep. Yeah, that did not turn out well. Oh, you know what? That did, did turn out too bad at all. Look at that. Okay, we're buying fertilizer. It's expensive, but we're buying it nonetheless. Okay, there's that. Now let's open the seed, cor seed door. Wait for it. Oh, I want, can I please, can I please have seeds? Um, I think I have to reset this maybe? Wait for the door to shut? Something like that? Okay. Now we're opening it all the way. Usually this will work. It kind of tricks it into thinking that it's not supposed to be doing what it's actually doing, even though it's actually doing it. Ha 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 ha, look at that tricked again all right so we've got a whole bunch in here we got like 18 19 000 liters of seed 18 000 liters of seed we have 16 000 liters of fertilizer in here so we're good to go there we do need to fill those guys up over there though they are going to be doing uh oh yo are we about to have a crash no they are about finished which is nice all right so get this dropped off there spin back around we need to go get the cultivators or the cedar section the air drill i'm just looking at the buy anything mod and thinking that might be in the way moment of truth how stuck are we gonna get i know we're gonna get stuck i just don't know how stuck um relatively <laughs> If relatively could be a uh, way to get stuck, that's that's how stuck we were. Relatively stuck. Let's get this backed up here. What we're gonna do is this is going to be what we are going to drive. We're gonna drive up and down. We're gonna hit headlands at the top and the bottom. As Soon as these guys are done doing the lime anyway, we should be seeing here in just a second. Helper finished work, helper finished, helper finished. Except for this idiot right here. And I'm not sure where this guy's going, but there's, I don't, I don't know where you think you're going. Where are you going, by the way? Just, just curious. Are you turning? You are turning. Barely. But you're turning. Where are you going? I don't, what did you miss? You've missed nothing. <laughs> you're fired. These guys are idiots. Get off my field. Okay, we are full of seed. We're full of fertilizer. We are set on soybeans. And we are about to get it rocking. We're not going to do a whole lot off screen between now and the next episode that you guys see. Wow, look at the white tracks on that, cr that quad track. That is so cool. I mean, the tires look cool. But man, the tracks, you can see them from here. We are going to need headlands big time. Thank goodness we have the case quad track. We're going to get this set. Soybeans are going in, guys. Soybeans are going in. We're getting our fertilization state as well. Seed, fertilizer, it is all good. Hire worker. But with all that being said, that is going to be it for today. Hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. If you're not already, please subscribe. If you have any questions, drop them down in the comment section below. And make sure if you want to get all notifications for the channel, make sure to click the bell icon and select all notifications or all if you're on mobile. YouTube's doing some funky stuff with notifications lately. There's a couple channels I have had to redo everything with because it just wouldn't let me do stuff anymore. And I'm not happy about it. But good thing is there's an easy fix. But with all that being said, hope you guys have a great day. And we will see you later. Peace.